Grooming Your Dog 10 Tips for Pet Owners Following a 100% worldwide increase in online searches over the past month for grooming your dog at home, there is no better time of the year to bond with your pet other than National Pet Month. Experts at shorestoyu.co.uk were keen to uncover top tips for bathing your dog at home. To do this, they investigated various tips and tricks online, revealing the 10 most essential steps when bathing your dog. Clip your dog's nails before bath time. Many dog owners forget that before bathing, it is important to check if nails need to be clipped. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. Long nails make it harder for dogs to have a good grip in the bath and will often fall over, especially if they are a small breed such as a Yorkshire Terrier. Gently place cotton balls inside the ears before bathing. One of the things dogs hate the most is getting water in their ears, hence shaking off mid-bath to remove trapped water. You can control this by placing a small cotton ball inside your pet's ears while bathing, providing your dog with a more pleasant bathing experience. Brush your dog's hair before and after bathing. Remember to brush your dog's hair before and after bathing. All dog breeds shed their hair, and it is best to get rid of any excess dead hair before shampooing. Brushing your pet's hair will also get rid of any matting and tangles before washing, making it a much easier and more pleasant experience for you and your dog. Wash your dog in lukewarm water, no more than 37 degrees centigrade. Always check the water temperature before wetting your dog. What feels warm enough on our skin? tends to be over 38 degrees centigrade, and this is, in fact, too warm for your dog's skin. Water temperature over 37 degrees centigrade can increase your pet's heart rate too much, causing a strain, especially for puppies and older dogs. Avoid getting water in the nose. It is important to wet your dog's face tenderly, but avoid getting water near the nose. The best way to do this is by tilting the head up and closely monitoring the nose. If too much water enters, they are at risk of choking. Tearless shampoo is a great option, especially for young puppies. Dog shampoo is not always vital, you can opt for tearless shampoos. These are usually sulfate and paraben-free, making them the perfect tear-free formula to wash your dog with. Avoid spraying your dog with full force water. It is imperative that the water pressure is low, as using harsh water pressure can be quite a traumatic experience, especially for younger dogs. By using a lower water pressure, you are also saving yourself from splattering dirty water all over your bathroom. Scrub the hair in the direction you want the hair to grow. It is important to scrub your dog's hair in the direction you would like it to grow in. This simple step will help avoid ingrown hairs, which could lead to bumps in the skin. Gently hold the back of the neck to limit your dog from shaking off wet water. If your dog is about to shake off all the bathwater before you have had a chance to wipe them down with a towel, simply hold the back of the neck and apply a small amount of pressure. This makes it impossible for them to shake their head, however, their tail may shake a little. Even if you believe that all the shampoo has been removed after rinsing, make sure you double or even triple rinse. Ensuring every little bit of shampoo has been removed is vital as any remaining suds can irritate your dog's skin. Dogs that do not like to be bathed. Martin Smith, the owner of shorestoyu.co.uk, explained what you should do when your dog is not a fan of being bathed. For those dogs that hate being bathed, it is important to normalize the bathtub. Many of us wash dogs very infrequently to the point that dogs feel nervous about being bathed. However, you can attempt to use the bathroom and tub when it is dry as a feeding location. This creates a positive association with being in or near the bathtub. Another tip that works well is to place a licky mat in the bathtub so that the dogs can have a treat and are distracted while in the bath, Smith concluded.